Rise and shine, everybody. A late morning train ride. Today's gonna be interesting. We're gonna go see Lydia's old grandma's house. So in a way, this place has been abandoned for a long yeah. time. Look at the bike. It's pretty old. That's why she said that little boy. Yeah, it's definitely, I see what you mean, why we couldn't stay here. It's, it's, it's pretty old and pretty, yeah. just everything was left just the way it was left, I guess. But they've been running out of the downstairs. Closet, so well. Blankets and stuff. It's, it's like exploring a, one of the old buildings back at home. Wow. Definitely. Like, life was here, but life is gone until we came today. And wow. Oh. Lydia's gonna stay here with her mom and they need to clean it and... Uh, yeah, there's a project here. Even the bath, shower area needs, needs help. The window's been left open, so the rainwater's kind of destroyed the wood there. Well, somebody was into a lot of drinking there, huh? Is this the balcony? Yeah. Wow. That's a that's the view. Oh, there's plants growing up on top of that. So yeah, definitely some work to be had. A lot of work. This is definitely not a not a day project, that's for sure. <clears throat> I don't know how much we'll get done. I think that's a microwave. Yeah, that area doesn't look too bad. It definitely needs organization. At least the cups and everything look okay. Don't think that's good anymore. That looks like it's been sitting there a while. Uh, See, ah, this will tell you the date that somebody was last here. Um, what year is this calendar? 2011 of November is when it was possibly abandoned. So yeah, about five years. It's just stuff everywhere. Newspapers. It's over here. Uh, the view of the garden and Another way to the balcony. TV antenna. Ah, there's the light. Let's see if it works. Mm, unfortunately, no, it does not work. So, light on the camera. Just a bedroom full of boxes. It's kind of sad. Books from the past of ancient history. Oh. See, her grandma got sick and had a stroke and has to live with family, so that explains why it just, they up and left. Oh my goodness. I am actually interested in this here. Yeah, I, I am gonna have to check this out later. Huh? Look what I found. I have gotta check this out. I wanna see if it powers on and what it does. We'll come back to this, guys. This looks interesting. This, I'm gonna have to play with this. Oh, look at the doll. Dun, dun, dun. It's like exploring a haunted building. Ooh, that's as far as the door opens, and it's really dark back here. Oh, a light switch. Oh, there's like no room in here. It's just full of boxes. I don't know what's back there, so you guys are gonna have to tell me what's back there. More boxes. Anything good back there? Closet. Ah, wow another room. Oh, it's the room we were in before. 
<laughs> just a shortcut to it. I want to see if this old computer boots. Well, kind of ran into a bit of a show stopper here. It took me a while to find the box with all the hookups in it. But then I'm like, ooh, everything's in here. And then I was pulling out the VGA cable. And... Yeah. It's... Fallen off or cut off. I'm not sure how that happened, but it happened, I guess, right? And it's kind of a bummer. But maybe there is a power cord for the computer, so we might just open it up, take a look, and see what's inside of it. And at least just see if it powers on and posts without a monitor. Unless there's another VGA cable around here somewhere. <laughs> okay, let's take a closer look at this thing. As you can see, it is very, very yellowed. It's got a CD-ROM drive, reset switch, floppy disk drive, um, power, and three hard drive LED lights. I don't think I've ever seen a case like that before. On the back here, got the power supply, case fan, printer port. Oh wow, it actually has USB. Um, mouse and keyboard, video card, sound card, and a modem. Okay, inside's in, inside's in pretty rough uh, shape. The dust is not too bad, a lot of yellowing on the cabling. Um, let's see, we've got, not sure on the modem there, kind of sound card. It is a Yamaha sound card. See a Yamaha sound card. I don't see any um, two uh, caps aren't bulging any. That's pretty good. Let's see what kind of memory we got going on here. I'm gonna have to say Japan NEC memory here. Intel Pentium 2 slot size processor. I don't know if I can see the clock speed on there. Unless somebody else can read that information. I'm not sure what it is but what i'm curious about i'm sure all you are curious about all right here we go give it some power okay here we go something's seriously not right here it is beeping so that means it probably is not posting wow so it does power on I can't don't have any way of looking at a screen to see what it's complaining about so I'm guessing there is a problem with it but not sure what okay it stopped beeping at me I just reseated the RAM and I heard the floppy drive do some things I heard the hard drive doing stuff so I am guessing it has posted. It's a bummer I can't actually see what's on it and what it's doing. Well, unfortunately, that VGA cable is beyond repair. I wonder if we could pick one up at a Daiso. So we might head to one and take a look and see what we can find. Because I'm really curious. I've got to know. They were explaining to me that this thing up here is how they get heavy luggage from downstairs. Hit one button, it goes down. Hit the other button, it goes up. Yeah, after that rainstorm, the suckers took quite a beating and now the leaves are starting to show a little bit more. And there's petals everywhere. Okay, it looks like our Daiso is gonna be in that building, second floor. This is one of those things I ask myself why. Because they're mini chairs, that's why. Well, this Daiso is not very big and doesn't have very much, so this may be a no Daiso. Yeah, no pun intended. But we've got phone jack splitters, SD card for micro SD to large. Um, I don't know what this is. It's teeny. SD card holder, cell phone chargers, USB cables, a regular cable. Ethernet, uh, a sushi key keychain, that's all I've ever wanted for a Hakuin. Oh, I'm 
going to eat it. It's like a sushi train. I got that one. It's a weird looking bird. But here's mine. <laughs> yep. This just happened. Ah, an Ed on. I bet you I can find what I'm looking for in there. Well, I found one for 10 bucks. Let's hope it works. You know, I should have tested the monitor to see if it powered on, right? Okay, the VGA cable's on. Here we go. Let's make a noise. Oh, I saw something there. Freeway design. Okay. We got something here. Windows 98 on here. Interesting. Oh, I've never seen this scan disk in Japanese before. This should be interesting once I get to a desktop. I couldn't find a mouse for this thing lying anywhere. So I might have to go look around and see if there's a mouse somewhere. But <laughs> you do got a keyboard. And man, this keyboard's yellow and in rough shape. Uh, it's a Japanese keyboard. Never seen one before. Uh, we know this computer at least been sitting here for at least six years, so. Okay. Mm. Uh, we'll just hit enter on that. Uh, it's detecting drivers. I will come back to it here once we get to a desktop. I don't know how long this is going to take. Okay, I'm working on a Japanese computer while in a Japanese neighborhood. Life couldn't be better right now. Okay, so what do we got on this thing? Let's open up the start menu. I couldn't find a mouse, so I guess it's all keyboard. Um, we got Office. Let's go to Programs. Mm. Jet System, Microsoft Office, Sutato, uh, okay, Startup Applications, Asus Live, Explorer. I wonder what. Okay, so it had a printer. That was must have been the printer we saw out there. What's Live Door? Uh, let's see what that is. Um, oh wow. Okay. I don't know what it is, so I'll just cancel out of that. Let's see what else we got to play with here. Programs. I wonder what version of Office is in here. Oh wow, 2000. Hmm. A little old, but you know it works. Holy cow. Look at that menu. All right, what are we working here? 128 megabytes of RAM, Pentium 2 processor, Windows 98. Oh, Windows 98. Let's go ahead and go into my computer. I'm just kind of curious what kind of hard drive that is in there. Um, a hard drive, uh, four gigabyte. And there isn't much space used on it. Let's see what's in the document folder. Some files, some pictures, nothing in pictures. Uh, what's this folder? It's kind of a weird name for a folder. What do we got in here? Can't read it, but we'll just see if there's something in there. A bunch of these, I don't know what these files are. Let's just open one. Not sure, whatever. Oh, I need a code for it. Oh, it's doing something. I think it's a game. Okay, so these are like saved games. Uh, height. Or some kind of. I'm guessing like Monjong game. Um, yeah, that's what I'm guessing it is. Too bad I didn't have a Linux disk or a live CD with me. I would try that out. Oh my god, there's a disk in there. How long has that been sitting in there? Uh, it's got some printer software, Microsoft Outlook. Oh, there's a CD I just put in there. Presented by... And it's another Shou Shouji video game. Not sure what that is. But, can't really click on anything because I don't have a mouse. You know what, I want to open Microsoft Word and see what it's like to type in Jap on a Japanese keyboard here. Go back into Word. Well, this is weird. So if I go, key. Okay, and see. Ah, okay, that's how that works. Suit. 
Okay. And let's say if I wanted a kanji like, um, I, uh, down, enter, I, uh, well, I wanted to see how I can get kanji on here. Because I don't know what these two keys are here. This is something, uh, Lomanji. Press Alt and that. So, nope, still in Japanese. Ah, oh, wait a minute, I got something here. And that's how I get kanji. Okay, how did I, how did I bring up that menu? I right. go ahead and quit that. No. Let's see. Let's see if there's like any email on here. Oh, so is someone used to have an email account on here? And what's this one? Akusenla Senali Accessories. Let's see what's in here. Oh, okay. Accessories. Yeah. Notepad, paint, all that fun stuff. A Japanese Windows 98 Pentium 2, 128 megabits bytes of RAM, 4 gigabyte hard drive computer. Yellow of the crap. Has been powered on in six years, has been stored in this house. Man, if I, if I lived here, it'd be kind of fun to play with this and restore it and clean it up and put a Linux distro on it. But, yeah. Cool find for the last day. Oh my goodness. Remember that screensaver? <laughs> Here's an add on pamphlet. So, I have a, a manga on one side of it for you to read. And some advertisement of anime chicks selling you a cell phone. Oh, I'm gonna go find my drink. I need to find my drink. <clears throat> my green apple drink, so I'm gonna sit out here, drink this on the porch, and enjoy watching people in the neighborhood. And uh, soccer off in the distance. Well, we're out of here. That was a fun old house to explore. And in that room, I discovered a neat little computer treasure. Man, even though my wife's staying here longer, this is where they'll be staying, so. I wish I was staying as long as they were, but I got, unfortunately gotta get back to work. And look at how this is designed. Isn't that interesting? It's really unique and different, but cool. So, bye bye Japanese house. Take care of my wife while I'm gone, okay? Oh, we're on our way back to get dinner, and we found this really cool indoor mall. Neat. And she's looking at haircuts. And they're a little pricey. Oh, 18 bucks. Yeah. Oh, they weren't kidding about that. They got a whole meal ready to go, and we're gonna cook it up in the center of the table. We got some vegetables, we got some meats over here. Yeah, this is gonna be fun for last dinner in Japan. Ah, sashimi. I mean, so is he putting oil on there? It's fat. Oh, it's just fat? That's it? Yeah, it, it's lard, actually. Oh, okay. Mmm. Hot, 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 hot. There we go. Oh, wow, we're done with that, and now? It's time for some cake. Well, it's bedtime again. I've got a long day tomorrow. Yeah, I've got to leave Japan. And some one old lady that we met as we were leaving uh, Lydia's grandma's house gave us this fan. Isn't it cool? It's made out of wood. It's really neat. So I'd like to say from this time and every time on, folks, keep on clicking on my Japan vlogs. Xanthony from Anthware, signing off. Yeah.